have several questions for you, and please answer these questions. Have you ever lied before? Have you ever blasphemed God's name before? Have you ever stolen anything, no matter what the value it was? Jesus said, Whoever looks upon a woman to lust after her has committed adultery with her already in his heart. Have you ever looked at another person of the opposite gender with lust? Have you ever broken the Sabbath before? If you answered yes to all of these questions, then you have admitted to lying, blaspheming, stealing, lusting, and breaking the Sabbath. You have to face God on Judgment Day. Are you going to heaven or hell? If you die in your sins, then you will end up in hell where there is weeping and wailing and gnashing of teeth. To go to heaven, you must repent of your sins and put your trust in Jesus Christ. If you repent of your sins and put your trust in Jesus Christ, then you will become saved and you will get everlasting life in heaven. Jesus Christ died on the cross for your sins. God will forgive you of your sins. It would also be a great idea to read the Holy Bible daily. The Bible says today is the day of your salvation. Repentance is urgent because you do not know when you are going to die. I am not using fear tactics, it's just straight facts. You need to truly repent and put your trust in Jesus Christ to become saved. Please think about this. Welcome to Happy Hour Food Review. Hey, right, so today I'm doing a food review on the hot honey. Oh, the chicken and waffles from Hardee's. Oh, yeah, I've got it right here. Oh, um, now let's unwrap this thing. Oh, there we go. Okay, so let's. <clears throat> the Shignan waffles are sweet. Um, they are a nice breakfast indeed. Um, uh, uh, um uh, I haven't gotten to the fussy part of this yet. Um, that's uh, likely because I didn't. Oh, well, that's likely because I've only taken several bites out of this. And the waffle is nice. Well, quite nice. I, 
Uh, Alright, so um, this is our oh, Stamwork Quarantine. Um, this is Succulent. Oh, um, it, it is what's a um, robust sandwich. Uh, um, so there, there is a nice hook of quality of chicken in this. Um, alright, so... Um, 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 for the right to go, um, so living... Oh, there is gonna be a video on the flood theology that is coming up soon. In series 3 of my videos for God willing. And it doesn't have some interesting stuff right there. Uh, I saw in the honey hot chicken and waffles. I saw some bites. Are crunchy, and some of them are not so crunchy. Uh, so it, it does sound like a spicy menu item, um, but so far this has not been very spicy. Um, uh, uh, you saw, saw the edge. Chicken and waffles are you know, very popular in the southern states of the U.S. Um, yeah, so chicken and waffles are, are, are really oh popular over here. Oh, and that was the um, the honey hot chicken and waffles. I so thought it was certainly not very spicy. It was good, and it was second. Okay, so on the scale of zero to one hundred, I'm giving the honey hot chicken and waffles from Hardee's a um a nice. 77.5 out 
seven. I was seven one hundred. Um, that was a nice crunchy taste in some bites, and then in the not so crunchy bites, you still had that sweet taste in there. And I would recommend this for breakfast. Um, oh, and if you're on a diet, then I would recommend getting this for breakfast on one of your treat days. Uh, um, oh, please subscribe to my channel. Have a nice day. Goodbye.